Hey guys, it's Petunia Gal, and as you can see, this is not Glacial Awakening. <laughs> so I have decided to start Sky Bees. So this is going to be a lot of fun with skies and bees and things. <laughs> so this will be coming out on Thursdays, and then Glacial Awakening is coming out on Sundays. So I hope you enjoy. Let me know what you guys think about that plan. And um, there is also Seopolis I was thinking of doing, so let me know if you'd rather see that one. Um, this is just kind of like a trial, I guess, to see what you guys like. And uh, yeah, so let's get to it. So uh, I did something a little different when I set this pack up. It actually has a game rules section, so I went ahead and turned off mob griefing and fire tick and, you know, all that good stuff. Oh, we already, we already have the saplings in our hands, so we don't have to worry about that. But yeah, so I did it through that and, um, I don't know. We'll see if I did everything right, <laughs> but let's get going. And yes, we do have fast leaf decay, but like I said, we already had a, um, sapling, so we don't have to worry too much about that, but let's see what we got in here. So we got our quest book, which, uh, welcome to my very first mod pack. Uh, use set home to set your home point and slash home to port back to your island if you are falling down. Okay. So let's let's go ahead and do that real quick. Uh, I don't know if I want this to be my home, but we'll go ahead and do that for now. So let's do set. Uh, why is it not working? That works. There we go. <laughs> The keys were not working. So let's see, set home and there we go. So we got our home set right here. Again, not really the best place for a home, but let's go ahead and do the first thing you usually do on a Minecraft mod pack, which is make a crafting table. Yay. <laughs> um, so we'll get that going. And I would like to get a little bit more area here, I think. So <laughs> I'm going to try to do it without falling off. You guys know me. It's, it's not going to work. Uh, do we have the, do we have tinkers? I don't think we have tinkers in this. We do. Oh, cool. All right. Crafting station. There we go. And I think there was one where, you, yeah, you can make a slab, but I'm not going to worry about that. We'll just make a regular one right here. And let's see if I can place this down without falling off the world. So... Go ahead and hit shift. Actually, I'm going to put this down a little bit. I would really like to uh, bring this down uh, a little ways so we can have some room here. Ah, oh, man. We lost it. All right. I think what we could do is just dig down to, uh, okay. I don't want to go that far, so we'll stop there because I don't want to go so far as to lose the, um, or, you know, go, go as far down as the bedrock because I don't, I don't like the way bedrock looks and, uh, so I don't want to do that. Um, we will go ahead I'm going to keep that much grass because I want it to spread. So we can go ahead and break these, I think, right? I hope I don't mess this up. But we'll keep this one and that one over there. Okay, I think that'll be a good a good option. So let's go ahead and uh, you know I'm going to fall off of this thing. And I know I'm going to fall off this thing. It's just a matter of time, honestly. So it just takes one slip of my finger to... Uh, to fall off <laughs> but we want to get as far down here as we can and okay I didn't know if I was gonna lose that or not but there we go and obviously we don't want to make this too big because we don't want to uh, get mob spawning right and until this grass spreads we're not gonna be able to I don't think we can put a sapling right next to that right next to this too tall uh, thing here. So we'll put it here, see what happens. And I think 
Do we have the torque? Yes, we do have the torquing mod. Okay, cool. So let's see if we can get this to grow. I think it may actually grow on a bit by two tall things. We just, um, yeah. <laughs> uh, I think it just grows ones that are taller if it's next to the two block high stuff. So we'll go ahead and do this. We want to make sure to keep uh, at least one sapling because, you know, we don't want to lose a sapling. I think there is a an, an emergency sapling in our book. I'll have to I'll have to check, but usually they're they're good enough to do that. Give us a little you know safety net there. Uh, so we got that grass spreading there. Once it spreads, we can get this torn down. That would be great. So let's go ahead and do this. I want to. There's not really any place to put. It. I really want to make a chest. Oh, no, not the astral tome. Does that mean we have astral sorcery in this? Because, oh, no, that's not good. I don't like astral sorcery. Okay. <laughs> it's fine. So we've got sky pack. Uh, for sky block maps on servers, use... Yeah, we don't have that. Uh, players can use slash island. Uh, don't worry about that. Okay. Oh, that's not what I want to do. There. Why can't... Uh. There we go. I was hitting E to get out of it, but no. Um, emergency of engineering, black iron ingot quests, open the I don't know what all that is, but okay. Sure, we'll we'll go with that. <laughs> in this pack, you start with X in the high X in the kilo, I think. I don't know. But the main generation of materials are bees. You start with normal Minecraft bees with enough resources, you can craft the eleven base bee spawn eggs. The other resources bees you have to breed. Okay. Uh, let's do the check mark. Awesome. And then we get, uh, I changed some recipes to make it a bit harder. Great. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Uh, there is no ore excavation, but you can use FTB Ultimine. Okay. Easter eggs. There are some Easter eggs. Okay. Good to know. Uh, if the pictures in the quest book are broken, reload the Skybees resources pack. If you have any tips, bugs, or ideas for X quests, let me know on my Discord. Okay. Um, there are some spell spelling issues in this one. But, yeah. Uh, let's see. Not every quest has a reward. The quests are only to help you a bit. Okay. I mean, I'm kind of used to that. So, there we go. Yay! Chapter 1 done. <laughs> All right, so that is the starting one. So now for X Nihilo, Nihilo, I, I don't know how to say that. Um, so we need 32 oak logs. Okay. And we've got eight. <laughs> All right, fine. So let's go ahead and do some of this. We need to expand. Oh, we got grass. Yay. <laughs> um, let me look on the... Let's see, options, controls. Um, so, FTB, I think there's some like thing you have to type in for the FTB um, Ultimate. No, here you go. So, it is the grave key. Uh, do we have any conflicts with that? I think the orange ones means conflicts. So, let me see. Uh, there we go. Ultimine is that. Sort external inventory. Um, okay, so I'm just going to make that like apost apostrophe. Yeah, that'll be fine. So we got that. So what we should be able to do now is if we hit the um, tilde key or the key right above tab, we can vein mine. Awesome. Yay, that works. Okay. So yeah, I know I'm going to probably lose a lot of um, saplings this way, but what I do want to do is go ahead. I feel like I'm going to lose these. Let's go ahead and you see, <laughs> why do I keep losing those? Why don't they just come to me? I don't get it. All right. Seriously, come over this way. We need like a magnet mode or something. Jeez. Okay. So what I'm going to do is like I said, I don't want to make this place too big, but we'll go ahead and hit shift 
And I mean, I'm super nervous when I hit shift to do this because I'm always afraid I'm going to let go. And you guys know it's going to happen. It's just a matter of time. But I do want to make this big enough where we don't have to worry so much. Okay, that looks a little weird, but that's fine. We'll lose that dirt if we break it now. So let's go ahead and do this and that, I guess. I don't want them to be too big, but like I said, as long as we keep some saplings in our, um, in our hands so we have them, we'll be fine. So... Let's do this, and we'll break that. And we could um, make an axe, but I'm not super worried about it because, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just not super worried about it. But let's go ahead. I think I said we needed 32, and we're pretty close. Oh, we can't do the <laughs> we can't do the the twerking if we're stuck under the leaves. So we're gonna have to break that. Okay. Oh, that's not what I want to do. <laughs> like, not jumping. Oh, you have to hit shift. Duh. Okay. This will be good. Come on. Come on. Will it not grow? Okay. Well, it's fine. We've got enough, I think, if we break this. So it should be fine. There we go. We did it. Yay. Another quest done. Uh, let me make sure I'm not in the tree, though. Uh, let's see. Okay. So we got that done. Super cool. So now we need to... Uh, well, we made a crafting table. Oh, we need to actually... Okay. Well, I don't think we can make this back into a crafting table, so I guess we'll just make another one. Which is fine. We'll make some planks, because I'm sure we're going to need them. And that will be that. And let's make... Oh, gosh. That just went everywhere, didn't it? There we go. So we got a crafting table. Regular one. Super cool. What does this do? That just sorts it. So there we go. Okay. Cool. Because we did not need that everywhere. So let's see what else we need to do. Now we need to make... Okay, let's make barrels. Uh, we can uh, obviously just make a wooden barrel, but that'll be fine. So we need planks and a slab. We can do that. So let's do, um, let's get out of here. Um, where do we want to put our, well, I guess, since there's this little hole here, let's put our crafting table there. Okay. So we need to make a slab like that. And I keep putting the stuff in a weird place. We need, I'll, let's see, can we make two? I don't think we can make two. No, we can just make one. That's fine. We got plenty more wood. I mean, we can make more, but there we go. And that gives us a wooden barrel. Awesome. So, uh, what we can do with that, um, let's just put it right. Actually, we could put it over here. Um, no, I don't want to lose the stuff I put in it. So what if we just put it right here? <gasps> no! Aw, oh, man. I did not know that was a thing. Okay. Well, let's make another one. Because <laughs> I did not know you could put stuff under blocks like that. But okay, that, that's not what I needed. Um, let's go ahead and make some more planks then. So, yeah, you can put stuff under blocks. That's weird. But now I know. So let's go ahead and do that. And we'll put a slab like that. Awesome. Okay. There we go. So <laughs> let's try this again. Let's put it there. There we go. All right. <laughs> I know this is a very small area. But it will be fine. It will be fine. Okay. So let's do this. We'll go ahead and I'm just going to put quite a few saplings down. So we made the barrel. And now it wants us to get dirt. So what we can do with that is we should be able to just put dirt, uh, put leaves in the barrel and get uh, 
dirt, I think. Or do we need... Let's see. Uh, can we do that? It doesn't show... It shows actual leaves. Right? Um, I think they may have made it where you can't just use saplings. Oh, no, there's saplings. Okay. Wait, I don't... What? Okay, I'm so confused. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. So what we can do, I'm going to I'm going to skip ahead a little bit is let's see. Can we do this if we make a crook? Okay. So what we can do with the crook, we did get a quest done. Awesome. Let's do this and we can do that way. Did that not give us Okay, yeah, so that gives us a little bit more um, saplings to deal with. So we can put saplings in here, and that should make us dirt. Let me go ahead and vein mine. I just got to be careful not to vein mine the, uh, the ground, because that would not be good. There we go. Got dirt. Awesome. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put that back down. So that is super cool. We got that done. Uh, what is that? Dirt generator? You need a hopper or pipe to extract dirt from the generator. So we need dirt, we need water, and we need lava and glass. Okay, we're not there yet. <laughs> okay, and then we can put silkworms in the leaves, and now it says infesting leaves. So we can get these leaves to be infested, and then we can get leaves from them, a uh, string from them, which is super cool. So let's see. Um, we can make the the sieve first but to make the actual like sieving part we need string but we should be able to make this we need sticks planks and a slab so we got that super cool and I hate to break any of this dirt <laughs> um what I'm, I'm gonna break it let's see Awesome, we got back. Okay, it's a little a little weird that you. I don't necessarily like that too much, but oh wow, we already got. That was fast. I mean, they're not all infested, obviously, but let's go ahead and use our crook. I don't. I think you can just use a regular thing, but wow, sixty four string. Okay, cool. <laughs> we got stuff. So let's go ahead and break the the uh, wood here oh no that did not work let's break it again I think I let go of the tilde key too soon all right definitely need to make this place bigger I will work on that in between episodes um let's see what else we can do real quick before we leave this one I do want to get that string uh mesh made that's what it was mesh I was trying to remember what the <laughs> what the uh name for it was Let's see, mesh, and we just need this, and that's just string, and there we go. Super cool. Uh, can we put silkworms into the composter? We can. I mean, that's one thing we could do with them. We don't have to, but that's one way to do it. So, uh, let's see. What is our next thing here? I don't want to do that yet, obviously. So we've got the sieve, which we did. Seriously? Are you going to make me break this and lose it? Yep. I'm not going to fall down there after so it. I'm you got to keep looking that. in the book because if you make the thing before the quest is available, I don't think it actually takes it. Yeah. So now we got it. Okay. So now we should be able to put that back down. And then we will put our string mesh on top of that. Okay, cool. So uh, we got that. And <laughs> that kind of threw me off. What were we doing? <laughs> uh, we did get the mesh. Okay, so now we need the uh, pebbles of cobblestone. So this stone petals, uh, pebbles... 
We need to sieve dirt and get the stone pedal pebbles, which will get us cobblestone. I keep wanting to say pedals, and I do not know why, but it's fine. So, so far we just got two dirt, and uh, we will go ahead and sieve that, and that should give us some stuff. Okay, got five pedal pebbles. Oh my goodness. Why do I keep saying petals? I, I don't know what's going on right now. All right, so we got a cobblestone. Yay, our first cobblestone. Awesome. Okay, uh, achievement made, Stone Age. Yay. Okay, so we got some seeds. Uh, we got a jungle seed, granite pebbles, uh, bee root seeds, got fern seeds, and cactus seeds. Awesome. So we got some seeds going. I uh, definitely need to make more dirt, though, but let's see. Can we, I was hoping we would get that as a reward from somewhere. We get another cobble for that reward. That's not really what I needed. Um, wooden crucible and a torch. I was going to say, wooden crucible should be fairly easy. Let's go ahead and hit, can we hit A? Oh, we can. Okay. So it has the bookmarks in this, which is super cool. I love the bookmarks. And I just want to see, oops, uh, if we click that. Yeah, that's just the regular uh, stuff. And I don't know. Can we just make a regular furnace in this pack? Oh, no. <laughs> if you skip a recipe, you just have to go back, uh, hit backspace. And that will take you back to the previous recipe, which is super cool. So, yeah, we didn't, We need to get the, same, the eight, um, eight cobble, and that will get us the stone that we need to make the furnace but that'll take a while like i said i've got a lot of seeding to do um can we use well we only have two so i think what i'll do is i'll probably make at least one more probably two more uh barrels i'm going to expand this out a bit but we can't expand it expand it out too much yet uh, until we get torches, because I don't want things to start spawning over here, because that would be bad. <laughs> but yeah, I think that's probably going to be it for this one. Um, let me know what you guys think of the progress, if you want me to do more off-camera. This one is just kind of uh, getting you guys introduced to the pack, and yeah, just starting out, because, you know, we're in the sky again, and we're going to work with bees. So that'll be fun, right? But again, let me know what you guys think about this series or if you'd like to see something else like Seopolis because that was my other option. So, um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. And I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, definitely hit that thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel or haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell to get notified of videos as they come out. And if you uh, have any questions, comments, tips, anything like that, leave those down below in the comment section I love seeing those, and I'll get back with you as soon as I can. And, uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!